This is Celebrity Thursdays. Every Thursday, we present you with another celebrity. Today, we're looking at 15 Things You Didn't Know About Mariano De Vallejo. Welcome to Alux.com, the place where future billionaires come to get inspired. Hello, Aluxers. Today, we have a special man on the radar. He's a street icon, model, internet celebrity, entrepreneur, and Instagram darling, and we could just go on. These are only a few things about Mariano De Vallejo, the hottest Italian blogger of all time and one of the biggest men's fashion influencers. De Vallejo was born in 1989 in Assisi, Italy. At the age of 18, he moved to London and then to New York to see what the outside world had to offer him. Years later, he created his own blog and then brand called MDV Style, just because he noticed that a lot of men needed fashion advice. From then on, De Vallejo became synonymous with elegance and the Italian lifestyle of luxury. If you're new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and follow us on Instagram at Alux. Stay with us to learn how this model turned influencer took the internet and fashion world by storm and why he is a lesson in how to be successful and rich by following your passions. With all that said, let's take a closer look behind the scenes. Number 1. He was discovered on a street in London by a modeling agency. Mariano De Vallejo's fashion career started pretty early in his life. At the age of 18, he decided to move to London and then on to New York to study acting at the New York Film Academy. That was actually a great start since he later signed Abercrombie & Fitch, which had a revenue of $3.4 billion. Mariano worked with modeling agencies Models One and Mika Stockholm. Models One is one of the largest in Europe and also the agency that discovered Twiggy and Yasmin Le Bon. And supermodel Linda Evangelista is also represented by them. Number 2. Mariano De Vallejo has more than 11 million followers on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Mariano is known as a street style icon who can easily combine more elegant, classic styles with minimalist designs. Combining blog posts with images was a winner, especially on social media, where he now has a huge following of more than 11 million people. On Instagram alone, he has 6.2 million followers. His website immediately took off in 2012 as he constantly posted great advice, insights into his daily routine, or how he likes to choose his hairstyle and plan his outfits. Mariano also likes to offer people a peek at his family life, workout routines, and share travel pictures. Number 3. De Vallejo was part of the cast of Hollywood's comedy Deported. Although De Vallejo is focused on his career as a model and entrepreneur, he also found time to follow his childhood dream of becoming an actor. He made his debut in the 2017 movie Deported, a comedy about a guy whose girlfriend is deported to Canada. This movie had an innovative approach since it brought together more seasoned actors and web celebs, including Mariano, Alexis Wren, Jay Alvarez, and Sarah McDaniel. The movie was produced by Yoram Globus, who worked on more than 350 productions, including Cobra starring Sylvester Stallone and Thelma and Louise. Number 4. He modeled for big brands such as Hugo Boss, Tommy Hilfiger, and Roberto Cavalli. The model-turned-blogger had a lot of inspiration for his blog posts to begin with since he has gained experience by working with some of the most luxurious brands in the world. De Vallejo modeled for Hugo Boss, Tommy Hilfiger, Maserati, Omega, and more. He also modeled for the Roberto Cavalli's Don't Go Unnoticed campaign in 2012. Number 5. Mariano De Vallejo has a net worth of $4 million. Apart from being a model and blogger, Mariano De Vallejo is also an entrepreneur. According to him, much of his working day consists of making phone calls and dealing with the business side of things. He's also worked with Levi's and other brands since starting his blog and wrote a book in 2016. De Vallejo has an e-commerce site, Know How Style, his own product line, and on top of that, in 2016 he became a TV personality in the Italian show Selfie, Things Change. Basically, he seems to have it all figured out since his endeavors brought him a new net worth of $4 million. Number 6. 
Mariana De Vallo released a song called Wait For Me in 2017. The feel-good hit of the summer brought to you by Mariana De Vallo? That's right, people. If you thought his ambitions stopped at modeling and movies, well, you're wrong. In May 2017, DeVaio released a music video for his song called Wait For Me on his YouTube channel. However, a year later, the Wait For Me video has fewer views than a video of him getting a haircut in Los Angeles, and the reactions to it were definitely mixed. While diehard fans praised him no matter what, Others are more critical of the excessive use of auto-tune in the song, and also the fact that, well, it's actually a masked ad for his clothing line. Number 7. Model Sergio Carvajal said that working for him was a nightmare. News spreads fast when influencers fight, especially when you have millions of followers. Mariano De Vallo posted an Instagram story about a fellow model, Sergio Carvajal, accusing him of being spoiled and arrogant. Sergio later made his own YouTube video about the incident, in which he described feeling deceived and that he felt like everyone wanted to take advantage of him. It turns out that De Vallo invited him to a networking event in Mykonos, Greece. He was also promised a luxury experience and a stay at a five-star villa. However, it turns out it was all a ruse to get Carvajal to work for De Vallo's company for free, and he ended up staying at a cramped accommodation with 15 other people. Ouch, better read the fine print next time, Sergio. Number 8. Fans thought that he was gay after appearing on Selfie. Things change. DeVaio appeared as a mentor on the reality TV show called Selfie, Things Change, in which he helped people deal with their insecurities and change their self-image. He also has become close friends with Stefano De Martino, a dancer and choreographer, a relationship which some say went beyond just friendship. However, he quickly dismissed accusations of being gay in real life, saying it was normal for two guys from Naples to hug, kiss, and high-five. He also said that Stefano is a great man with good principles, and they had friends in common before the show. Plus, DeVaio has been happily married to his wife and has two sons. Number 9. He's an advocate for transparency in online advertising. Italy and the rest of the European Union has had a crackdown on influencer marketing, saying that hidden advertising has to stop. That has affected thousands of bloggers and social media influencers that now have to use the hashtag ad. Mariano has been a supporter of this initiative, saying that declaring brands and revealing ads helps him to be more honest with his followers. He believes his relationship with his fans is based on trust and that companies haven't stopped working with him because of the dreaded hashtag. On the contrary, he noticed an increase in followers and offers. Number 10. Mariano De Vallo is a brand ambassador for Maserati. Mariano De Vallo has succeeded in moving beyond the fashion world and into the equally glamorous world of luxury cars. He is a brand ambassador for Maserati, which has a revenue of around $4 billion annually and is a very well-known Italian luxury vehicle manufacturer. In fact, De Vallo is often seen in a Maserati Quattroport, which costs around $350,000, or is driven around by a chauffeur. He's also a motorcycle enthusiast and can be regularly spotted at motorsports events like MotoGP and the 24-hour Le Mans race. And Aluxers, if you fancy more cars, then head over to our video about the most expensive Ferraris in the world. Click in the top right corner to check it out. Number 11. He was recognized by Forbes as the most influential man in Italy. It seems like his work has not gone unnoticed by social media as well as mainstream media. Mariano De Vallo was named as number one on the list of the most influential Italians under 30 by Forbes. In an interview with him from May 2018, De Vallo opened up about his life as an influencer and entrepreneur, saying that, Success for me is a roller coaster ride. You have to know how to adapt and enjoy its highs and lows. He also describes how his business grew from one employee to having no space left in the new company headquarters. We think that it's pretty much a sign he's on the high part of this roller coaster ride. Number 12. He launched his first fashion collection in 2018. 
Only a few weeks after the Forbes recognition, Mariano launched his newest collection, Mariano de Vallo, in the Galleria Vittorio Emanuele in Milan. And it just shows that this fashion icon is not afraid to go all out with the made in Italy style and everything it represents luxury, quality, and of course, self confidence. The line includes shirts, leather goods, jewels, shoes, sunglasses, and more. To look like Devayo, all you need is a good $300 pair of shoes, $1,000 jacket, and of course, a $900 suit to go with a $200 pair of aviators. Number 13. Devayo makes around $9,000 per Instagram post. No matter how much mainstream media love he gets, Mariano stays true to his social media followers. Well, that's also where the cash comes from. You see, each time he posts a picture of a hot new look or driving an expensive BMW, he makes around $9,000. However, Adweek.com has estimated that the return of investment for the companies might be double as men everywhere will race to buy that pair of jeans, hairstyle product, or motorcycle. That just goes to show the power influencers have, and particularly that there's no stopping Devayo right now from growing his audience and his earnings. Number 14. He dated his wife only nine months before marrying. Devayo defies all the stereotypes of a playboy who mingles only with celebrities and other models. In fact, he tied the knot to lawyer Eleonora Brunacci in a lavish ceremony at Castello de Procopio, a private eight-bedroom castle back in 2015. But this fairy tale almost never happened, since Eleonora refused his advances at first, and she had recently ended a previous relationship and didn't want to jump into a new one too soon. However, she realized after nine months, she also had strong feelings for him, and they stuck together. Eleonora often appears on his social media and has more than 700,000 followers on Instagram herself. They also have two sons together, Nathan Leon and Leonardo Leon. Number 15. He has his own e-commerce shop, company, and clothing lines. Mariano De Vallo is synonymous with taking your five minutes of fame and stretching it into years of fame. In fact, while blogs are very hard to maintain and it can be very difficult to gain a following, his quick ascension to celebrity is an inspiration to us all. Mariano knows that people want great advice, and they also want to follow his lifestyle of luxury for inspiration as he serves as a role model to millions of men. In addition to having his own clothing, accessories, jewelry, and shoe collections, Mariano launched his own online shop called Know How, which has a revenue of $3.4 million and around 65 employees. Well, Alexers, that's a wrap on Mariano De Vallo. He dominates the men's industry and is one of the most loved and respected bloggers turned businessmen of our time. But since there are so many influencers, we want to know what you guys think. Will this online influencer trend disappear someday? Let us know what you think in the comments. And as always, for sticking with us all the way to the end, of course, you get a bonus. Here it is, number 16. His son has over 200,000 followers on Instagram. While his wife is not a celebrity, Eleonora has embraced being an internet influencer over the years. Even more curiously, their eldest son Nathan also has an Instagram account managed by his mom. Nathan actually is the youngest user of the platform, having 229,000 followers at the tender age of one. The account is mostly photos of the toddler playing, but also modeling kids' clothes. His baby brother is quickly following in his footsteps, with 43,000 followers. And who knows, maybe these kids will be able to buy their own house by the time they turn five. Thank you for spending some time with us, Aluxers. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpicked these videos, which we recommend you watch next. Thank you for being an Aluxer, and we'll see you back tomorrow.